and welcome back to my youtube channel so as you can see the setting is a little bit different because i'm going to do a q a and answering all of your questions i asked you guys on instagram stories and here on my youtube channel if you had some questions for me and there were quite a lot of questions so um, yes i'm happy to answer them if you're new here on my channel, I would love for you to subscribe. I upload twice a week, every Wednesday and Saturday. And I make a lot of beauty, Disney and vlogs. So if you like to see that, definitely make sure you subscribe and hit that notification bell. And of course, you can also follow me on Instagram. And now let's get started with the Q&A. So let's see what you guys want to know. I thought maybe a Q&A was nice because the last time I did a Q&A it was in the summer I believe. It was also filmed on my phone because that time I hadn't had uh, a camera yet. So um, yes I thought it was nice to do a Q&A because I got a lot of new followers. So um, yes. Okay so let's see the first question is tips for anyone starting a YouTube channel. So I got a lot of tips that I can share with you, maybe what software I use, which editing program, how I edit my videos, um, yeah a lot of things. If you would like to see a separate video with everything that I learned, uh, let me know in the comments down below then I can definitely make that one for you. But a few tips that I have is definitely make sure you upload regularly. That word is really hard for me to say. Regularly, regularly, regularly. So choose uh, once or twice a week. I think it will be best. Minimum once a week. Best maybe twice a week. And also stick to that. So don't upload maybe a few times every week after a few months not. I think that's not really uh, good if you want to grow your channel. So definitely make sure um, you stick to your plan of course it can happen that sometimes you don't upload a video of course i understand that maybe if you're sick or busy with your work university of course i understand that but i think it's best that you stick to uh, stick to your schedule because i think youtube will see that and they will boost you in the algorithm so more people can find you if you are something on the back side, it's the fireplace, not the one on the television, but the real one. It's really cool. As you can see, I have a blanket right here. So if you hear like that, woo -doo 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 -doo, it's the fireplace. I also think it's so important that you just put your first video on the internet. I know I was so terrified of my first video. I think I filmed it even twice or three times maybe. Because I'm such a perfectionist and I thought it, I was not good enough. Now. so don't be afraid to start a youtube channel just go for it just do what you love film what you love i think that's the most important thing and you will learn with time i mean my first video was terrible but um yes i just put it online put it on youtube and um, i think that's the most important thing to just do it but like i said if you want to see a separate video with all of my tips where i show you everything let me know in the comments down below the next question is what do you love most about going to disney so what i love most about going to disney is of course the rides i'm a huge fan of rides and i love the parades the meet and greets just the magical time all together i love making memories with my family i think it's so yeah so nice and just the whole experience really the most magical place the most happy place on earth and yes i just love love disney if you love to see some disneyland paris vlogs i will put um, the link somewhere up here so you can check them out but yeah definitely just the whole experience the next question is do you have any new year's resolutions or goals for 2020 so to be honest i don't have like one big goal or new year resolutions but of course i would love to grow my channel in 2020 i would love to hit the 5000 subscribers and if i'm really ambitious i would love to hit the uh, 10000 subscribers I know that sounds crazy because I'm only at 2000 right now but um, yes I would love to grow my channel. I would also like to eat a little bit more healthy and to exercise more. Maybe as some of you guys know I was mentioned it uh, in my other video. I have some problems with my uh, vitamins and I got shots for that 
and I just hope that I become a little bit more fit and not so quickly tired and yes I would love to worry less to just uh, have faith in life that everything will work out and that I'm not so overthinking everything because I'm a major overthinker I think they are my uh, new year's resolutions I also got a lot of questions about my husband which is quite funny uh, someone asked if I have a boyfriend uh, yes a husband he's my husband now he was my boyfriend he's my husband now so yes I do have a husband and then another question I've got how long have you been married in March it's our uh, fourth anniversary so I've been married for four years I married when I was 21 quite uh, young so the next question I got not really a question but we love to see your hubby ever plan on having children so I understand you are curious to see my husband and he's sitting right over there but he doesn't want to be on camera I would love to film a video together with my husband but he just doesn't like to be on camera or photographed at all he's he's not the type that can sit with me and Yes, I think he would be a little bit uncomfortable. <laughs> Maybe in the future he will. Maybe. Do you want to make a video with me in the future? Yes. Yes? Mm -hmm. Maybe. 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 And the other question was, uh, ever plan on having children? So yes, of course, I would love to have uh, some children in the future. We are married four years now and here in Turkey I got asked all the time um, are you pregnant are you having a baby here in turkey it's really normal after you marry you start trying to conceive a baby very fast so uh, yes of course i would love to have some children in the future and maybe i can also cooperate that uh, with my channel maybe it's become also a little bit of a mommy channel in the future who knows next question is what kind of music do you like so I listen to a lot of different genres of music I wouldn't say I listen only to one genre say so yeah, I listen to a lot of pop music I think um, I love Harry Styles uh, newest album I also love to listen to 80s music really a lot of different music styles I like 80s uh, I listen to ABBA and I love musicals so I love to listen to musical music my taste in music is all over the place I would say the next question is do you work if so what do you do at the moment I am not working here in Turkey I am just a housewife it's about visa and rules here so I can't work yet at the moment also the next question was um, if I go to college so yes I went to beauty school if you call it beauty school in English I think I am a hairdresser and makeup artist so uh, in the Netherlands I was work in a hair salon for a while and I really love to do that I love to do makeup and hair it's just something that I really love but yes at the moment moment I am not working the next question how old are you so I am 25 years old and in August I will be turning 26 the next question is what kind of hobbies do you have right now my biggest hobby is YouTube Instagram um, I love to watch movies to watch Netflix one of my biggest hobbies is dancing I love to dance I started with ballet after I danced uh, street dance, hip hop, mm, I was not really good in that. <laughs> And after I danced ballroom and Latin and I think that has to be my favorite so ballroom and Latin I danced for many years and I just loved it I loved every single dance I love to do the little competitions in the dance school yeah it was just something that I really love to do after a while unfortunately uh, my dance partner and I stopped with dancing because he went uh, to the army and because I'm quite tall and um, I couldn't find another dance partner so unfortunately I uh, stopped when I was 17 18 years old but I still love to do like Zumba lessons on my TV or dance works out or dance workout I just love to do that and I also love to swim in the summertime because I'm living near the sea uh, swimming is one of my biggest hobbies I just love to swim in the past I also did competition swimming and um, yes that was something also that I really love doing I'm not that fast anymore anymore like I was before um, my muscles are not there anymore it's just soft <laughs> but yes I love to swim in the summertime 
The next question is how and when did you start making videos? So for many years I was thinking about starting a YouTube channel You know when I was at my makeup table I was pretending to film like hi everyone and welcome back to my YouTube channel something like that after I got this phone with quite a good camera I I thought to myself, okay, let's just start. Let's just start practicing, making videos and look where it's going. So I used my phone for quite a few months to film my videos. I think I started last year in April. I think I started in April and I was just hooked. I just love to make videos and after a few months I thought, okay, now I can maybe buy a camera because the quality is of course a lot better. So that's how and why I started because I just love to watch YouTube and I thought, okay, I can also do this. I want to do this. I want to share the things that I love. So um, yes, that's how I started. The next question is, what are you planning for your channel in the future? So I just hope to continue the content uh, to make what I'm making now, some beauty, lifestyle, turkey vlog, uh, maybe yeah in the future if I have children, maybe I will also make some mommy content because I also love to watch uh, those videos, maybe it's a little bit strange because I'm not a mom, but I love to watch family vlogs or something like that. I don't think I will be a family vlogger. Um, but I think I will share maybe like what's in my diaper bag or baby names I love or videos like that because I also love to watch them so yes just continue the videos I make now and I hope of course to grow my channel let's see if you haven't subscribed yet subscribe to my channel let's hit the 5k this year maybe the 10k so that's the plan for my channel in the future the next question is who are your favorite big youtubers so I watch a lot of different youtubers I love to watch uh, SL Miss Glam, Ready My Love, uh, Fashion Mumbler I also love to watch Nikki tutorials she's also Dutch I love to watch also Mr. Beast his challenges he's one of the biggest youtubers out there he has such fun uh, friends and challenges I also love to watch that like for family vlogs I love to watch uh, Tara Henderson and uh, Tiffany Beeston. Yes, I watch so many YouTubers, but uh, those are a few I love to watch. What and who inspires you? What makes you happy? And what's your biggest goal for this year? I think a lot of my friends and family members inspire me. Like my mom who is sick and always keep positive and keep going. My mom is such a big inspiration for me. And yeah, I just keep my inspiration from a lot of different people. And also, uh, if you talk about famous people, I really love Grace Kelly and Audrey Hepburn. And what makes me happy, like a lot of the small things in life actually, like when I see my family again, you know, I live in Turkey, so when I visit Holland, um, I really love to see my family, that makes me so happy. There's a lot of street cats here outside in Turkey and it makes me happy to give them food and to cuddle them. It makes me happy to swim in the sea in the summertime. Just really the small things make me happy. And the last question is, what's your biggest goal for this year? So my biggest goal, like I said, um, I don't have really resolutions, I think. But the biggest thing is I hope to not have that much anxiety this year. To just let life go and not try to control everything. I think that's my uh, biggest goal for this year. The next question is, do you like living in Turkey? And do you have plans to live anywhere else? So yes, I love to live in Turkey. Um, I moved here because of my husband. And um, that's also a question I got asked a lot. Why did you move to Turkey? Because of my husband. He's Turkish and um, if we wanted to live in the Netherlands, it's quite hard with work because I need a contract. There's a lot of rules about um, bringing someone from uh, Turkey to the Netherlands or to Europe in general. There's uh, so many rules, it's really hard. So it was easier that I moved to Turkey. But yes, I really love to live here. Life is really nice here. Difficult to move country, like because all my life I lived in the Netherlands and after I just moved to Turkey. And of course, Turkey is so different than the Netherlands. 
so there were a lot of things that I have to, uh, had to get used to and it also makes me really happy that I live near the sea so um, yes I also made a video uh, what I love about Turkey uh, I will link it up somewhere here also if you like to see a video like the differences or more things about Turkey I think uh, on my channel they are most popular so uh, yeah let me know in the comments and then I can make a video uh, again about Turkey and of course the question uh, do you have plans to live anywhere else um, no not at the moment uh, maybe one day we will go back to the Netherlands I'm not really sure but for now we are happy here in Turkey the last question is a really fun question which Disney princess describes you the most so my favorite uh, Disney princess has to be Cinderella I love Cinderella since I was a little girl she's always so kind to everyone although not everyone is kind to her and she's always really positive so I really love Cinderella and I hope I can be like her to be kind to everyone to be positive and um, I don't know I hope to be like her maybe I'm also a little bit like uh, Rapunzel because Rapunzel is really adventurous so I moved country that's quite adventurous I think and she's also really funny and cheeky and I will also love to be a little bit like her and of course my hair I hope to get her hair that will be awesome so this was a q and a I hope you guys enjoyed this video if you did then don't forget to give it a thumbs up subscribe to my channel and for more girly content and other things you can of course follow me on instagram and I hope to see you guys soon in one of my other videos bye